Hello everyone and welcome to the channel Alpine Valleys Go. Elena is here and today I'm going to show you my favorite city in Switzerland. To all this beauty, you can't believe that this is real. It must be was painted by someone in Photoshop. Switzerland is a land where everyone could find something for his or her taste, solitude and adventure. And today we are in Luzern. Luzern is a historical Swiss city and one of the 10th prettiest city in Switzerland. It is situated in the central part near the most beautiful lake in Switzerland, Lake of Luzern or Vierwaldstatter Sea. Within, uh, within a stunning mountain, Sridian Pilatus in Swiss Alps. If you have time, you definitely should have a hiking over there. All of our trips start from airport or train station. At our point of arrival, there is no airport, so we start our journey from a train station. A magnificent railway station in Luzern, unfortunately, was destroyed by fire in 1971. All we can see now is this old arc, which once was the main terminal entrance. It's very, very beautiful, so don't lose the chance to make a photo with it. The Chapel Bridge is the oldest covered wood bridge in Europe, dated back to the middle of the 14th century. It was built in 1365 as a part of fortification of Luzern. Chapel Bridge is also famous because of the marvelous painting covering the roof of the walkway. It was painted in 17th century by a local Catholic painter Hans Heinrich Wegmann. Next to the Chapel Bridge, you will find another Luzern's most famous landmarks, Wassertun or Water Tower. Both together, they create a most famous postcard of Luzern. Chesser Church is the first Baroque church that was built in Switzerland. It is recognizable from afar. To be honest, I didn't expect nothing special from the church. But the minute you open the door and step inside, you are totally paralyzed by beautiful and stunning view. I can't describe all this beauty by words, but this is a place that you should see by your own eyes. Sproja Bridge is a little brother of the Chapel Bridge. You should also walk over it as it has fantastic view of the city from across the river. Next to Sproja Bridge you will find a middle dam that was constructed in 19th century for controlling water level of Lutheran Lake. Here you will also see a river power station. Today it's still in use and around 1000 houses are getting energy from this power station. When I'm visiting new cities, the main place that I want to see is Old Town. And Luzern is not an exception. It has very old buildings, so be attentive to small details when you're walking around. These houses will tell you the history and the life of the city. This is a great place to spend a few hours and lose yourself in the old century. And in a few steps you will find a modern life with restaurants and shops. 
Putin is a great combination of old and modern lifestyle. Our next stop is the place with the best view to the entire Luzern. Music Wall is one of the longest and best preserved wall in Switzerland. Here you can climb and overlook mountain and lake and entire Luzern. Here you will also find the oldest watch in the city. Hofkirche is the most important example of the church building from the Renaissance period in Switzerland. It is a parish church of Luzern. This is my favorite place for a walk in your city. If you have time and you are not in a rush, you definitely should visit this few kilometer walk spot. The view of mountains and lake will follow you and open its beauty from a new side. The last point of our trip is the park near the Museum of Transport. This is my favorite spot to enjoy the beauty of the surf. Here you will find green, green grass, calm and blue lake and stunning pilatus. I hope you had fun with me and our trip and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more information from Switzerland.